don't know if you can see that or not, but boy, I almost walked into that little guy. He came up in the campsite and put this whole web up last night. Anyway, we're getting ready to take off. So here we are, we're at the highest elevation in Florida, 400 feet or so. <laughs> but uh, that's where I'm gonna be hiking, down in there, somewhere. Trail's gonna wind around. Should be interesting. Isn't it nice that we've got these beautiful areas that have been preserved? So it should be a tough hike though, it's gonna be hot. So here you go. Got a nice big warning sign just before I get on the trail. So what we did, if you look down here, I put the uh, safety pin in there. That will should keep these with the equipment malfunction on the first hike. That'll keep these uh, from getting, <laughs> coming on. I guess you can kind of see <laughs> they, they got some work to do on these trails. It's going to be I'm glad I'm not carrying a backpack back in here. I'll tell you that right now. I mean, I got a little pack on, but not my real backpack. Got to get through here. Oh, boy. That's where that walking stick comes in handy. There we go. Now you're going to look there. Spider web right here. Oh man, I tell you, I hate getting face full of spiders. All right, let's keep going. Man, look at the devastation from Michael that came through. I mean, we we're way inland. Can you imagine what it was like on the shore? No wonder they had a, <laughs> just now getting these trails somewhat passable. But I mean, you can just look at it. I mean, obviously they've been in here with the chainsaw cutting that, you know, but uh, I guess all this was probably covering up the trail. I mean, they said almost every tree of any substance went, went down during the storm. All right, well, let's keep going. So I think I'm on the trail. <laughs> I'm not quite sure. <coughs> but this is, uh, wow. Okay, yeah, it looks, looks like a trail to me. So no way I could carry a pack on this trail. Look at this. I know they're working, but figured it was going to get get kind of crazy here. Well, get some video on the other side. Man, look at the size of some of these trees that Michael took down. I mean, what is that, a hundred-year-old tree? I mean, imagine the root system on that thing for the storm to just, just take it right down. Pretty insane. It is, uh, for Florida, this is an up and down trail. That's exactly what they, the way they described it. So, and boy, I tell you, it's no wonder they warn you about the snakes. I mean, a lot of times I, I can't see where I'm putting my feet. So if there's a snake down there, he's going to hit these leggings. And I'm glad I got them on. I hate carrying the extra weight, but uh, better safe than sorry. Anyway, so we're, we're kind of descending down into the, the uh, lower areas here. I'll get some footage next time we get a good view I, I should have taken some up on the ridge so I didn't know what this was you know once again I I'm seeing a fence in the middle of nowhere and then you can hear the water I guess I, 
get this up maybe you can see it. yeah there there we go now nah, it's recording <laughs> i don't know why phone's being finicky maybe it's getting too hot so check that out pretty cool huh a little waterfall but i saw these fences here and i'm thinking what in the hell are these fences out here for but i guess this once upon a time was kind of a bridge and you can see the a little stool behind there if you can kind of get down so i gotta work my way through here somehow let's uh keep going so i swear it's hard to tell if i'm on the trail <laughs> so i hope i won't have to turn around but we're going to keep going through this and uh, hopefully it'll open back up and we'll see what happens but uh yeah can't go right can't go left let's just go straight ahead so a little bit of a pickle here i gotta be off trail there's just no way certainly don't go that way that's what we just came through so i'm gonna head back and if i can't pick up the trail i guess i'll just have to head on back and come in in a different spot and there's a couple places where the uh trail goes up onto the road i hate, hate turning back already but uh you know, I'm not going to just continue in here and get totally lost. So let's uh, let's try to get back up through here. Well, I guess that's it. I hate giving up, but, you know, you can kind of see. It looks like, you see that fence there? I don't know. Looks like this is where the trail used to go. But I don't see any way through that. Unless I want to have my machete with me. So, kind of disappointing. I'm going gonna, gonna to turn back right here and... We'll try to pick up the trail at a different spot. So we'll see you on the other side. I gave it one more shot. But there, see that spider? That's enough to turn me around right there because I can't get through all of this. Yeah, I got my bug netting on, but uh, this is just, if, there's a, if that is a trail, <laughs> I, I don't see it. All right, well, hate giving up. Talk to y'all later. Since I'm heading back, this was what I forgot to do on the way in. So we got turned around there. But this is, we're way up on a ridge. Boy, I tell you, I'm not used to hiking up and down. I'm down in central Florida, it's nice and flat. Even though I did the distance, I didn't do the, the terrain. But uh, kind of a good view, seeing what the forest looks like there. You know, let's get a little more of the trail. I mean, you can kind of see it's, they gotta, they're gonna have to do a lot of work to get this trail back from the storm. It's a shame, but uh, that'll probably be it. We'll uh, see you on the flip side. So I thought, thought I'd get a little selfie here for rethinking the, the plan. So this is where having that air conditioned bathroom is gonna be <laughs> real nice. So I'm going to get in there and get a nice cold shower. It's getting up to towards noon. and Boy, the temperature's really picking up. And this up and down, I'm not really quite used to it. So big deal. So that'll be good. We'll, we'll just ride out the heat of the day. i take the bike out. Maybe we'll hit some of these uh, primitive camping areas and see some of the rest of the park. All right. Guess you can see why they said they've been working. Look at this. Look at that tree that Michael took down. My Lord. And then of course this is, <laughs> this is the trail. So I gotta get through there. We'll see what happens. I'm gonna tell you what, when we get to that parking area, I, I won't be coming back this way, just a little more devastation. That won't easy getting through there. But uh, here we go. I mean, the trail, you can tell they're working on it. I mean, it's, it's getting there. I think the phone's overheating here. It keeps bouncing on and off. But you see the sign here. We went, we went that way. That's where we had to turn around. We got on that trail. So looks like it goes this way. So let's go ahead up to the parking area. And at least we'll check out a little bit better. Because otherwise we just head back to the camping area. So let's get going. I just don't see what that is up there. I'm curious. So you remember that structure we saw from the trail? I finally found it. <laughs> Check this out, isn't this cool? You could, I suppose you could rent this, it looks like a little cabin. 
<laughs> and then, but as luck would have it, the door is open. So check this out. This is what you would you would have if you stayed here. Probably not supposed to be in here. <laughs> you got your little table, and uh, it's kind of just a little circular. And there's your air conditioner with a bunk bed. Kind of a neat place to stay, and you got your vaulted ceiling fan there. Cool, huh? Yeah, you never know. Let's get a view from the porch here. So if you were staying here, you know, you could come out here and <clears throat> have a picnic. Get this view. Not bad. Well, we made it. <clears throat> so I can see this is this is the road where I came in, so I know where I am, and there's the there's the dumpster down there. So take a break right here. Take the take the pack off here and then the water pouch and chill out let the got a little bit of a breeze and uh well that'll be it for maybe some bike riding for today anyway talk to you soon